Hi, welcome back to another video. Today, I'll be doing a short rant about some warrior cats that I personally haven't really heard other people talk about much, so I thought I'd do that. So if you couldn't tell already, I'm drawing clear sky and gray wing. These two tomcat brothers have a great kind of lore, I guess you could say. So a very brief summary for the story, if you haven't read John the Clans and you'd like to understand a bit more. For those who don't like any form of potential spoilers, I'm so sorry. So Clear Sky and Grey Wing are brothers who join the cats from their tribe called the Ancient Tribe to go and find a new place to call home. Eventually, the cats find the forest in which Firestar's story starts. Hence the name of this subseries, Dawn of the Clans, this is where everything starts, the making of the clans, etc. Over time, after settling, Clear Sky begins to become hostile to the others, including his brother Greatwing. Clear Sky is more focused on surviving no matter what, rather than sticking with the original group. Some other cats agree with him, and they make a new camp away from the moor in the forest. This causes lots of conflicts between the two different groups, and eventually the great battle breaks out. Now to talk about the art for a little bit. Early for Earlier for Clear Sky, I gave him a very strict, bold pose with the ears pointing straight up and forward, trying to show the new character that he became after they reached the forest. For Grey Wing, I flattened his ears and gave him a slightly sorrowful gaze towards his brother to show Grey Wing's thoughts and emotions as Clear Sky turned on the more cats and completely dismissed him and Grey Wing's previous relationship as brothers. While I'm finishing up the sketches, I wanted to talk about the two more as individuals. For Clear Sky, I have a few thoughts. Though for most of the subseries, Growing is kind of like the main character, and you don't see that much of Clear Sky, I still think Clear Sky has one of the best character buildups of Warriors as a whole. In chapters where you're in Clear Sky's camp, it's very interesting to see any personal or inner conflict of Clear Sky. In some ways, he can be relatable slash understandable, as prior in the journey, he did lose his mate who was carrying his kids. And yes, though Clear Sky makes the stupidest deci decisions ever, like turning away his only live child, you can kind of understand where it comes from. For me personally, Graving is ever so slightly more relatable. If my sibling, whom I was super close to, turned on me, I would also be super hurt. So for the coloring, I decided to have Clear Sky more on the cooler end of the color spectrum and Grey Wing on the warmer end. This is partially for some color differentiation and partially for character purposes because Clear Sky became a little more cold hearted I guess you could say. So I decided to make his color palette more cold, less welcoming. Also, Clear Sky made me think, well, the sky is blue, his name is Clear Sky, so, you know. Grey Wing's more on the warmer side of the greys, because I thought it looked better for the composition, and also because he was kinder and more welcoming. So, I'll be completely honest here. Dawn of the Clans was where I first started reading Warriors, and I was so confused because I barely knew what anything meant. It took me a couple of books to really get a grip on what the books were actually talking about. This was almost three years ago, so I might want to touch up on that and reread Dawn of the Clans someday. Now, for the background, I was lost. I had no idea what I wanted for the background, so I kind of played around as you can see, and eventually I settled on this orangey amber color gradient thingy. It's most definitely not the best or most creative background, but I think it worked out okay. Thank you so much for watching, especially if you made it all the way through up to this point. I really appreciate it. If you liked this video, please leave a like and consider subscribing. If you have any suggestions on other videos I can make, or if you want to see me talk about some other Warriors or Wings of Fire characters, please leave those in the comments. Thank you again for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!